I'm joined by Teresa Smith, Albany Convention and Visitors Bureau, and we're here to talk about the Mardi Gras weekend. It includes the Snickers Marathon, you know, the Energy Bar Marathon, and it'll take place uh, Friday, March 2nd, and Saturday, March 3rd, 2012, and welcome. Thank you. And uh, so, you know, how long had Mardi Gras festivities in Albany been held? Okay, this is the 10th year of Mardi Gras. Yeah, so a whole decade. Yes, a whole decade. And so it's like 2002 when, when this was started, huh? Yes. Mm -hmm. And uh, so, uh, and besides the marathon, uh, what activities are being planned uh, for this year's uh, uh, Mardi Gras? Okay, well first, the Mardi Gras is actually moving down to Front Street and the Riverfront Park area. So that is one of our biggest and newest features. We'll have more room, more activities for kids, more food vendors, more merchandise vendors. And also this year we add in another stage that will run continuous bands and local groups from noon until midnight. Um, we'll have a stage in the park and we'll also have a stage near Flint River Aquarium. And uh, so, uh, so basically uh, most of the action will be moving away from uh, Broad uh, Avenue to towards uh, so towards the Civic Center. Towards the Riverfront Park area, yes. Mm -hmm. And then, um, so uh, and uh, so it'll be from noon until midnight. Mm -hmm. That's correct. Mm -hmm. Five dollar admission, kids ten and under free. Mm -hmm. And uh, you see, so given that this is the tenth uh, anniversary of the of the Albany Mardi Gras festivities, uh, uh, what is your you know, biggest memory of a, uh, of a, uh, what's your, what's the best, what's the Mardi Gras the, the celebration, what year do you remember the most? Well, I've been participating in Mardi Gras for the last four years, and my favorite w would have to be last year, despite the weather that was going on, it was freezing cold and it was also raining, but the city still came out, we still enjoyed everything, and we battled the weather, but we still had a great time. Mm -hmm. And uh, how many uh, people um, uh, do you expect uh, for this year? We're hoping, um, our goal is 60,000 to come through the gates. Last year we were right under 40,000, so our goal is to get 60 this year. Mm -hmm. So, and how much, you know, as far as average attendance uh, over the past, say, nine years? Um, we reached actually, yes. yeah, we reached out actually record numbers um, in 2010. We had 57,000 to come out. And so it's, it's been growing each year. Last year we were a little bit lower because of the weather, but yet and still we had a great turnout. Um, the vendors did well. So this year we are hoping to bring it back up and get 60 or over. And uh, what about the economic uh, impact? The economic impact is tremendous for the city. It's actually Rock Roll and Run Weekend. It's the second event that bring us, bring the largest number of economic impact after ASU Homecoming. So the Snickers Marathon, the bike race, the Mardi Gras Street Festival, the total race, it brings tremendous economic impact for the city. Last year, I think our economic impact was under three million, about three million. Um, would you share the would you care to share any uh, final comments? Just um, everybody come out to the event. We have tons of activities, local entertainment. Um, the kids area has been enhanced. Two stages full of entertainment, $5 a mission, kids 10 and under free. Just come out, enjoy yourselves, great food. Um, this is a great event for families. It's very family family oriented event. So, and also, if you have any questions about the entire weekend, you can reach us at the Albany Welcome Center. That's two two nine three one seven four seven six zero, or you can personally email me at t smith at albanyga.com. Thank you, uh, Teresa Smith, Albany Convention and Visitors Bureau, and again, the. 2012 uh, Mardi Gras uh, Festival and the uh, 10th anniversary celebration will be held uh, Friday, March 2nd and Saturday, March 3rd, 2012. And thank you, Teresa, for um, talking today. Thank you.